Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes and today I have two jewelry subscriptions to share with you. The first is Mint Mongoose and the second is Rocks Box. Let's get started with Mint Mongoose. Now this September set was sent to me for review. Recently, a couple of months ago, they increased their price and it went up to $29.99 per month and now on their website it does just promise two pieces of jewelry. It used to be three but I do believe they still customize in terms of a if you prefer not to have earrings, if you don't have pierced ears, or if your recipient doesn't have pierced ears, and you do still get to customize and choose if you would like to have gold, rose gold, or silver, and I think it's still pretty easy to change back and forth depending on the spoilers for the upcoming month. Sometimes there are designs that I feel like look better in gold or better in silver. I'm not usually a rose gold person, so usually they do send me the gold. Now, when they did do that price increase, they did not give me a new referral code. It used to be Noel. 50 and that will still save you 849 which was essentially 50% of the old price. I've reached out to them multiple times. I will definitely keep you posted if they update that code, but for now, if you do decide to subscribe, you can get 849 off using the code noel 50 I will definitely leave that for you in the description box below. I'll leave a link as well. It is not an affiliate link. I don't get any commission for this, but I do want to share and allow you to get some savings if you think this would be a fun fashion jewelry subscription to try out. So one of the cool things about this box though is that they do always include the inspiration behind the jewelry set for the month because it's all designed in-house by Helena. So it comes in this cute little envelope with of course a mint mongoose on it and I was just back home in Hawaii and I saw lots of little mongoose crawling across the road. They are adorable but they're a little bit of a pest. She also always includes a little sweet treat for us which I definitely love. And then here is our little, our card. So this one has, uh, instead of an image for the inspiration, it says kindness tic-tac-toe. So it actually is like a little challenge. Let's actually have kindness be our secret password for today. So in case you are new to my channel, when you come across the secret password, you wanna enter it along with your contact information in the Google form that I'll leave linked for you in the description box below. And then at the end of the month, I go through with a random number picker. I select a few winners to receive mystery boxes. There's usually around a dozen passwords sprinkled throughout the videos throughout the month. You do have to be 18 years or older. You have to have a US or Canadian mailing address. There are some extra rules or options for my Canadian subscribers should you win. You do of course have to be subscribed to my channel but doesn't have to be publicly because I can verify with you via email. I actually like to do that. So again our secret password for today is kindness so it's a good a little reminder. Um, some of the squares on here are perform a good deed, share with someone. Um, that's a nice one and of course we got our free space there which is a heart. So it says, what the world needs now is love, sweet love. So let me go ahead and read this to you. It says, this month's set is inspired by the importance and power of kindness in today's world. Oil and water, they naturally don't mix. In many ways, it seems like people have become oil and water to one another. Friendly conversations with strangers, smiling at someone in the store, or going out of your way for a coworker, in many ways has shifted away from the norm. However, this jewelry set is a challenge to change that. All right, I like that idea already it says kids stay the darndest things and our seven-year-old daughter especially is often challenging me to be a better human to those around me she keeps me on my toes and I love it she is a constant reminder to me to go the extra mile for those around me without a second thought regardless of how well I know them I was just like her when I was younger but somewhere along the line life and norms shaped me into something else something that could use some work in the giving kindness away like it's candy department so we have our two items they were wrapped up in this mint tissue paper which I opened up and it says uh, when you wear this jewelry set I hope it reminds you that while oil and water don't mix they do work together in many important ways and you have the power to make that happen if that's so true it's always a choice it says while you may not perfectly mesh with those around you you have an opportunity to make a difference using kindness right to uh, be that positive example. It says, I hope this jewelry set inspires you to take action and brighten someone's day. They don't have to be giant, profound gestures, but something as simple as holding the door open for someone for a few extra moments, rushing to help someone when you see they're struggling, or simply asking someone about their day and being sincere about it and actually listening to the answer, should they give you one, uh, can really make all the difference. So it says, love Helena, the mama behind the mongoose. So let me go ahead and open these up. So we do just have the two items. So so usually these days, uh, since they've shifted to just doing two items, it is a pair of earrings and a necklace. 
Sometimes before we would get two necklaces to layer, sometimes we'd get rings, sometimes we would get bracelets. Um, so this is like an abalone shell. I'm not sure if it's actual abalone. It looks like it is actual abalone. So here I got it in the gold. Um, now I do like these. It's a very simple design. We've definitely gotten abalone sets from Mint Mongoose before, but the color of course is really, really stunning. My criticism, my feedback has always been with Mint Mongoose that they should give us shorter chain lengths because this one is a really long one again. I wish that their default was to a shorter like 14 or 16 inch versus these longer ones which I think are more like 18 and then of course a daintier chain this chain because the pendant is pretty pretty big this kind of like elongated hexagon is not too bad because it's attached in two places but of course because of that attachment I can't just change out the chain and that's always been the case because of the way they do their clasps and their extender you can't do that um, and switch the pendant onto your own more delicate chain unless you actually have jewelry tools so I actually really like the shell I think that's very pretty I just really wish if they're only gonna give us one necklace that they would give us the shorter length and that should definitely be an option um, and that would actually be savings for them but I don't think that they watch my videos at this point because I've been asking for that renewed um, code and also because that's been my feedback for a very very long time even before the uh, price increase and now we just got some matching earrings they usually do kind of daintier earrings these earrings that I'm actually wearing are from Mint Mongoose these were some of the bigger more statement earrings that they've done. They always come with the little um, plastic or rubber backers, which is nice as well, but you can see it's basically just that same pendant shape put onto a little J hook. So these are a little bit bigger than the like teeny tiny ones that we get, and they are usually J hook earrings, even when the, uh, the little hanging piece is very, very tiny. We don't usually get studs. That's just the style that we tend to get. I don't mind this this set it's not very um not necessarily very different it doesn't like stand out to me it just is that same pendant um repeated as earrings and a necklace i would probably wear the necklace a lot more if it was on that shorter length chain and the earrings like you know it's nice to have a matching set sometimes i do think that color can be really striking i get how it's supposed to look like an oil slick um although that's kind of a weird like intention or I, I guess association because you wouldn't want to wear like oil on your on your necklace um, but it's not like my favorite set from them it's not my least favorite set from them but again I really wish that they would uh, <laughs> allow us to choose our chain length or make it so that the pendants on the chains that they send are um, ones that we can change out and even if they did different chains different months sometimes a chunkier one sometimes a thinner one that might inspire people to stay subscribed so that they can swap those chains out from month to month all right guys let's talk about rocks box which is a little bit more of a jewelry rental subscription it is 21 dollars per month i in california for example do pay a little bit of tax so it winds up being like 22 and change but you get to select a bunch of pieces to put on your wish list and then you will have someone's your stylist which i don't know that they like really do a lot of styling but they will select some pieces from your wish list or things that they think that you would like and they will send them out to you you get three pieces at a time that are yours to enjoy and wear and use for as long as you would like as long as you're paying that $21 per month then if you decide to hold on to any of the pieces and actually purchase them they do use that $21 in credit now if you don't use it during that, that month you lose it but you can keep the set for an entire three months and just purchase one piece per month using that $21 each time if you are a member and you're not just buying one-off pieces you also get a discount on a lot of them not necessarily with a lot of the more designer jewelry um, um, designer jewelry pieces like Kendra Scott, Kate Spade, there's not usually a big discount on those, um, but you also get a discount if you keep two or more pieces. Sometimes it's only a discount of $10 extra if you keep all three. Sometimes they have deals where if you keep two, you get $10 off and then $20 off if you keep uh, all three. I do have a referral link for you. It is uh, one that gets me credit, not necessarily just affiliate commission money, but it does get me credit with them. Uh, and I will leave that for you in the description box below. Or you can use the code Noel N B F F one, like best friends forever one, and that will get you your first set of three pieces 
for free and that $21 in credit. So you can basically try out three pieces that you select and put on that wish list or they send out to you. Um, and you can always swap it the night before when they uh, give you a little preview, you can swap things out. And then you can use that $21 in credit. So you can send everything back and not spend any money at all, or you can use the $21 and maybe hold on to one of those pieces. So it always comes in a nice mailer bag, a bubble mailer bag that is yours to use. They do pay for the postage for you to send it right back to them at the end of the month or the three months. Um, it comes in this nice box. I usually keep all of my pieces in the nice box because that's how I like remember to try them and use them for the month. And then we just have a little care card. And then of course the, um, the little um, sticker is usually down here in the bottom. So inside you can just see there's a bunch of little bags that are wrapped up in this rocks box tissue paper and then we do have our little cheat sheet like our little invoice that tells us what the items are and then we have three different jewelry bags so sometimes they are like for example kendra scott and sometimes they are rocks box branded if they're more of an in-house or if it's just a brand that doesn't have their own jewelry bags so this time around it looks like i got i think i got all earrings this time around because you guys know that's what i wear the most is earrings and then necklaces and then i will wear some rings but usually they're not necessarily the things that i hold on to i feel like the holidays are a really great time to use rocks box because you can get some more dramatic costume jewelry or uh, higher value pieces you might have more events to go to that you don't necessarily need to purchase outright they also have all kinds of sales especially around this time of year if you want to just purchase items on their own so let's go ahead and take a look at a few of these now the first one is from a company called Soko and I really like their stuff I've gotten a few pieces they're a little bit on the pricey side I will say that but again sometimes I have some credit stored up and again sometimes it's just nice to wear them for a while so these are the Maji dangle earrings in gold they are normally uh, $88 but they have a member price of $84 so for example I could then use my $21 in credit so then I would still owe $63 on that but you know they're kind of cool I love that they have a little bit of movement so they kind of look like they would be stiff the way they sit and they are on posts but then they have that little hinge um, which does create some dangle movement and you could wear it where um the longer piece is on the inside closer to you or whether the longer piece is on the outside I'm just gonna go ahead and try one on but I could see these being great just because I love the hammered gold so and I think that you could use them for holiday or like year-round so this is what it looks like there is the post it just has a simple backer um, and I usually buy a bunch of extra backs um, just from Amazon or what have you so I always have them on hand all different kinds let me see if I can get these on the post feels a little bit short but that just could be a little bit bent from being in there see I think those are really cool very very striking they have a little bit of movement um, I, it kind of looks like a threader earring but a thicker one because it's all on the front there I think those are really awesome they are a little bit pricey like I said but I might uh, keep them in rotation and then decide maybe those are the ones that I will splurge on because I do think I can use them for holiday as well then I went ahead and got some Kendra Scott earrings these were just kind of like fun and playful they're probably a little bit late in the year for me to get these honestly I think they might have just been in my wish list for a long time and then they finally showed up in one of my sets these are the Sloan Star open frame earrings in multi so maybe they came in uh, single colors as well but I got them in the multi color so inside there was this uh, little jewelry pouch or bubble bubble bag I guess so they have a retail value of 75 so less than these but guess what the member price is 75 because like I said on some of the designer jewelry uh, which is what you know they consider Kendra stock designer jewelry you don't you don't get the discount so these are just kind of fun they're big hoops but you can see they're on like a smaller huggy now for me sometimes these earrings are a little bit harder to get in place because you have to slide them in and then snap them closed um, but I just thought these were really fun and playful you know kind of like a fiesta vibe but definitely also a little bit more of a summery vibe they kind of match those uh colorful enamel earring uh ring set that i got a few months ago that you might have seen in a past unboxing but let me see if i can try these on like i said they might just be things that i try on for a day or if i had an event to go to i might wear them and then then that's what's interesting about these is I do feel like you could slide this whole thing off so they're kind of like two part earrings you could just wear the huggy just by itself and then of course when you want to be a little bit more of a 
party animal you could add on that big hoop, which does make them kind of, um, kind of multi-purpose because you might have a bunch of other hoops and other earring baubles that you could then add on. So those, those are nice and big. I do like them. I kind of like the uh, design where it's the huggy and then the big hoop because you wind up seeing the hoop a little bit more because it faces forward a little bit more. So they are pretty fun. They're very lightweight. I like that they're sort of dual purpose. I wouldn't really wear a simple like tiny little huggy that often, but I could see how it's nice to get like, you know, two pairs of earrings for the price of one, even though it's $75. So you guys let me know. I think they might grow on me because, you know, summer will happen again and I do live in a warm climate where, um, you know, this kind of earring might be something fun and playful to uh, add to a simple outfit. We do have one final pair of earrings. Uh, these are the Aster Lila Drops. They have a retail value of $65, but they are a member price of 55 and I thought these kind of had like a little bit of a vacation -y vibe too. Now I will tell you they are pretty hefty just feeling them on the card but same kind of idea you guys know I love the gold but I they kind of have that movement where they almost look like they'd be stiff but they're sort of hinged right here. So I think they could look really good. Uh, so my subtotal, it looks like, is $214. Uh, if I kept all three, I would save an extra 10. So they don't have the, like, keep two savings at the moment. Let's see if I can open these up. So they were actually not that difficult to uh, open and close. So you do actually have to get it to go right into the hole on these ones versus the kind where you push down. But for whatever reason, that was not too difficult for me to get them on or off, but now of course I can't even close them, but they kind of like fit, they fit well back into the slot. And the stars are double-sided with the enamel, so I do appreciate that, that they have the color on both sides and it's not like a, a side where it's a negative or, or you can't see it. So I'm trying to see, again, these kind of have, um, these are a little bit directional, so I think that I would want the, uh, the fern kind of pointing inwards um, so you'd have to there's like earrings with a right and a left which does happen sometimes sometimes they just look better certain ways just like I think with those Soko earrings I like the longer one being on the outside but see I can make it kind of curve in now they're not too heavy I'm used to like fairly heavy earrings like I got a pair of Kate Spade earrings once that were just too heavy for me to wear on a regular basis these would not be good to like have to run in so if you're like late to your dinner you wouldn't want to like be running in these but I do think they're fun I'm not sure that I would hold on to them these are ones that I've been looking at for a long long time I don't know that I would use them enough to justify $55 I guess if I was just gonna hold on to one and I subtracted that $21 in credit then it's not so bad but I do like the other pairs of earrings I think a little bit more definitely loving the Soko earrings of course the most expensive ones are probably my favorite actually these look really good again my hair and then I'm not sure that I need these Kendra Scott ones um, but they are just kind of fun and I do like the design of them so you guys let me know what you think about these three pairs of earrings if you had to just choose one let me know which one you would choose if you had to just choose two or basically tell me what order you like them in tell me what you thought about both sets this month I would love to hear and if you would like to try out rocks box like I said it's a great time of year to try it out you can get your first month for free and you get that $21 to apply to any of the three pieces that they send out to you and as long as you send them back within a month then you will have no charge at all i hope you enjoyed this video if you appreciated it i would appreciate a thumbs up it does help my channel out quite a bit and uh hopefully i'll see you all very very soon in my next unboxing don't forget there was a secret password if you missed it go back and get it i'll see you soon <laughs>